caddy. Our job is to get the jockeys from here to the starting gate. And, you know, as opposed to the outriders, which are like the lifeguards at the pool, we're more like people that are just watching our own person, our trainers, our clients' horses. And our responsibility is 13 minutes from when the grooms hand them off here to get them to the starting gate in good condition. He's worth gold. For what I do with the horse, I mean, because I work for trainers like Fletcher and Bafford and Bill Mott and those guys with million dollar racehorses, I can't have some piece of crap pony out there. Come on, boys. Hi, Quizno. How are you? What do you got here? <laughs> okay. Okay, perfect. Pretty much talk about everything. It, they're actually, because you, when you're here every day, I usually work all the races every day. They become like another family, like brothers. Uh, hey, wait. Get that horse in. You Come just on. bit me, pony. Come on, get that horse in. Hit yeah. It. Hit it. I'm going to hit you. Hit it. Oh yeah, the ponies are sometimes the high spot of the fans' uh, day because they actually get to touch a horse. And there was a guy here, 60, 70 years old, the other day, he touched one and says, first time I've ever touched a horse. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> He's giving you kisses. <laughs> All of these are boys in here. They're the babysitters for the racehorses. Yeah, all of these, the pony horses are all males. Because if you use a filly, when you take the stud horses to the gate, they'll probably get too fresh and happy and want to jump on them, try and breed them. It's not a pretty sight. Horses. I'm not a great people person, but I love the horses. Well, I ride horses. I love. That's what I. The only thing I know. I ride horses all my life. So. Get to be outside. Get to get to ride for a living.